Welcome to Romany's Realm, I'm Romany and today I'm going to talk to you about what's coming up on my Patreon this month. As you may know, if you've already seen my January introduction and overall introduction for 2017, which I'll link to down there if you haven't seen it, I have moved my year-long journaling class from a 12-month course into an ongoing course and it's now run on Patreon. This has several advantages. It means that I can change up the course as I go along and make it more interactive, more fun, respond better and faster to what people want to do. It also means that I can contain the class a little bit better because we can do monthly topics rather than having a topic that goes on and on and on. And we can look at different things every month without having a set structure to the class. For instance, last year was all about drawing and it turned out that 12 months of drawing was a little bit too much for a lot of people. So I think this way works better. It also means that you can drop in and out of the class as you wish. If you want to do the full class and have everything there and lifetime access and everything else, that option is still there. And if not, and you just want to drop in and out when you see a subject that you like the look of, then you can join one of the lower tiers. The class tiers start at $5. And if you don't fancy that particular tier that month, then I've also got a $1 tier, which is a, I'm still here and I want to support you, but I'm not interested in this month's class tier. And we've also got a $2.50 tier where you can get the main overall theme for the month and a colouring page to play with while you wait. So that's how Patreon works. And at the moment, if you join up now, you get February's class now. So you get access to February. This month's theme is the magic of the moon. For those of us who are pagan, new age oriented or doing some kind of spiritual thing. We have a basic introduction to astrology via the moon. So a little bit of astrological stuff starting in our planners. We also have a section on moon phases. So the full moon, the half moon, the dark moon and so on. And what they mean in magical terms. If you are not of a pagan orientation that is absolutely fine there is nothing to stop you concentrating on the astronomy side and actually doing the scientific side of the moon the moon is our nearest neighbor in the sky so it does affect us and we affect it and mankind's been there how cool is that so you could approach it from that standpoint if you're not into the magical side later on in the month we'll be looking at the different moons of the year which is actually part of the farmer's almanac. It's not just a pagan thing. It's for those who live off the land as well. What those moons are, what they symbolise, and the extra moons that confuse people a lot, like the blue moon and the black moon and the superstitions like blood on the moon and so on. Then we're going to look at lunar symbolism and what the moon means or has been taken to mean in various different ways. The various symbols that are associated with the moon and... You know, just the basics, rocks, crystals, metals, all that kind of stuff. The basic correspondences of lunar magic and astronomy. And then at the end of the month, we're going to have some fun with some more arty stuff where we're going to look at the myths and legends of the moon, the goddesses of the moon and all that kind of stuff. So you'll be able to do some art pages with lunar goddesses if you want to. You could look up the myth of the moon rakers if you wish and do something like that. There is all sorts of things to do with the moon because mankind has always been aware of the sun and the moon in the sky. So the moon has always played a large part in mankind's culture. For my journal this month, I'm still in my Janelli fish and I'm going to be using my beautiful, oh, look at this, isn't it pretty? My Nuna notebook in fluid chrome is just the most gorgeous thing and very lunar looking, if I may say so. And of course, to go along with that, I'll be doing lots of lunar decorations and things. This month is going to be really fun and it's going to be a nice transition between regular journaling for those who just want to journal and make pretty pages and kind of book of shadows style journaling for those of you who want to do the more witchy side of keeping a date book. If you'd like to join us you can sign up anytime, follow the link down below to Romy's Realm on Patreon, sign up and 
you're charged straight away and you have instant access to the class. Introductions go up this week so you'll get this video and a little look at the kind of things that I've collected to use in my journal this month and also the planning prompt which will keep you going for the whole month. That's where we're going to start looking at astrology. That'll be fun. If you need any help at all or you're not sure what tier to sign up for or exactly which part of the class is going to be most suitable for you, you can email me romany at gmail.com and either myself or Tracy will get back to you with some more information depending on what it is you need. There will of course be a flip of my January journal coming up which I have a couple of unfinished pages in but I can work on those at my leisure and I'll also be doing a video on how I get started in my journal when I'm starting a brand new notebook and I will share that on YouTube as well because it's a question I get asked all the time how do I set up a new journal? Well I'm setting up a new journal now so I will show you what I do. Hope to see some of you on Patreon and for those I don't see on Patreon, don't worry, I'm still here on YouTube and I will be doing some more videos for you this month as well. See you all soon. Bye.